Okay, this will be an interesting one. Uh, let's see if we can make it look interesting, this one. <coughs> it's text, and we're going to make it a uh, single colour. So, going black first. Come on, Konica. Minolta. <laughs> How big we're going to make this, I wonder. Oh, we're going to look at it later. Just set this up, this silly thing up. I'm going to make text enhance for that. Uh, <coughs> still got that damn flu, sorry folks. Right, let's see what we've got. We've got to enlarge it. We have here... Just a little picture cut out of a, um, a barbecue flyer. I just went to a barbecue recently and basically, yeah, they had this flyer on it, or this image of it. So we're just going to put this here. I'm going to enlarge it. It's going to be distorted. I'm going to need to enlarge it more horizontally than vertically. So I think vertical, horizontal, I think is about 400 and the vertical is going to be 300 and something. So let's just take a punt, 300 and 60. We're going 360. It's going to be distorted. So let's see how we go. Just put the dock feeder on it and let's see how we go. So yeah, starting with black. Let's see how this looks. Oh, it's going to look much the same, of course. Ha 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 ha. But that's all right. We'll do it like that. Uh, all right, yeah, 400 is still not long enough for that, so I'm going to have to use that as a master copy, but that's not too badly framed. I'm thinking we could, I think we'll frame it like that, and we're just going to enlarge it horizontally again. So we have got, it is too short, needed 400%, still not good enough, so there it is. We're just going to put that there on the, on the pile, and we're just going to enlarge it so now I'm just wondering so we're just going to keep it on black we're just going to keep we're going to switch it to copied paper even though it's still a text like the dots the half tone dots like out of a newspaper so we're just going to overlap the top and that because we're going to make it into a mirror image we're going to make it into something more interesting than just this picture of a, a bird having a barbie so now we're just gonna go like so we're gonna make the vertical very small vertical is going to be 104 and the horizontal is probably going to be 130 gonna make it 137 and see what we get Right, let's just print this one off, off this master copy that we've made, and see how we go. Let's see how this looks. Whoa, I think we cut too much off the bottom of the Barbie bird. Looks like the Barbie birds had too much, yeah, more than I, I thought it wasn't going to be that big. But you can see it's stretched vertically. So now we're just going to go, we're going to make it less way less so we're now going to go 120 we're going 124 for this and see how we go so see if our barbie bird looks better at like this okay out comes the barbie bird yeah, that looks better. And you can see we've got the wheels of the barbecues looking good. So now I think this is going to be the centre of our job. So we're going to now switch over to colour. I think we're going to do R, G, B and yellow. We're going to do those. We're not going to do black and white for this one. So now we're just going to switch over to some different colours. We're going to start with red. This settings.
Okay, up comes the red version of the Barbie bird. <laughs> we're just going to move that away. Just put that aside and we're just going to line this up here. We're going to make our Barbie bird look interesting. <laughs> okay, right, next colour. We're moving on to yellow. Hopefully that won't be too wishy-washy, but I think through the through the lens of this phone it should it should look easy easy to see than with the naked eye. So let's see how we go with this. Out comes our yellow quadrant. So yeah, that looks pretty bright, pretty uh, wishy-washy in some ways. But anyway, we're just going to put the corners together with that. Looks easier to see through, the, as I said, through the camera, which is probably a good thing because you guys aren't going to see it with your own eyes, of course. So. Now we're just going to set this up. Now we're going to switch over to green and we're going to quickly switch over to mirror image while we're at it. So we're just going to switch here, switch it on, and we're just going to pump off one in green and one in blue after that. Let's see how we go with our Barbie bird. <laughs> True blue Aussie barbie bird but it's not coming out blue it's coming out green at the moment but you know what i mean it's a true blue aussie barbie bird yep let's see this will be really true blue when we put this one in this is our final one so our barbie bird's gonna look really true blue okay enough of that aussie speak gets a bit old-fashioned it folks i mean the tourists probably like it but when you really when you live in Australia you sort of take these things a little bit for granted after many years of hearing it you know true blue Aussie hey true blue there's a song called that so it's a really old Aussie song and all these songs are a little bit old hat a little bit old-fashioned a little bit dusty uh, still people like them surprisingly so let's see how we go lining these up Right, okay, there's our Barbie bird, and I think now this Barbie bird demo is now complete.